My name is Nkiru Kauzoebuna. I'm a second year PhD student in electrical engineering. My research is in developing novel self-modeling behavioral therapies for young children on the autism spectrum using computer vision techniques, signal processing techniques, as well as privacy protection techniques. So the idea is instead, let's use their own image to teach them that when they meet new people or, or even people they know already, they say hi to them by doing a certain behavior. We use the concept of their face because we find that many kids on the spectrum pay more attention to their own face than, than they do to others. So the idea was to use their image to generate novel therapies that, that some psychologists, some therapists can use, or perhaps even parents can use in their day-to-day -day life with a young child on the spectrum. Let's say you want to make the child smile. Take that image, just a simple picture of the child doing whatever they're doing. Take that same picture and make a picture that smiles, that looks just like the child when he or she is smiling. So that's essentially what I'm doing. Take a simple picture and do stuff to it that makes it still look very realistic so that the child can believe it. It sounds easy. It's not quite easy because, again, you don't just want to create some kind of joker smile, some kind of Frankenstein smile. You want to make something that is realistic to the child, that, that the child will actually believe. I've spent the past year looking at psychological reasons for doing this in the first place, so you have a motivation for it. So I have finished that part of the research. I'm now working on the technical aspects of it, using essentially everyday tools you can find, nothing too crazy, nothing too expensive, so a parent can actually use the project in their home. I want parents to be able to take it home, to work with it, for it to improve the lives of the kids and also the parents as well. My aim at the end of my remaining two or three years here is to make a system that parents can take home, can build, can modify, can make bigger as the years go by to suit themselves and to suit the child. I want to be able to go home and make change in Nigeria for young kids with autism who many times go undiagnosed, untreated, and many times mistreated back home. So if I can begin to make that, that change back home, that, that will be my ultimate goal. <laughs> and I believe here at UK has increased my drive to go home and do things like that.